Templates are pre-formatted documents. They already have the layout that we need. It's all put together. It has the right coloring all put together, all the right fonts, all the right graphics. It has basically a full package theme ready to go for us to use. Basically, you can see all of our titles of our different areas here are in blue. Those headings are all formatted the same. Same font, same color. Our text is basically the same font. Our titles of all of our articles here are the same size, same font. Our little graphics are consistent. Our links are all blue and underlined when I go on top of them. You can see that all is very consistent, which means it's very easy for the user to keep track of and understand what they're looking at in your site. That's the purpose of a template. Now in Joomla, you can manage templates by using the Template Manager. It's an extension, so I'll go into there. The Template Manager lets us preview and apply new templates onto our Joomla site. Right now, the Milky Way template is the default because you can see the little star there. It tells me here I have an assigned column. That's if it's assigned to certain pages. If I use the Milky Way template for the majority of my site, but then I want to use the Metal template for maybe some special areas, I can assign that a different template. The version of that template, the date of it, and the author. There is an administrator side to this. You have templates on your front end that your users see, but you also have a template on the back end that our administrators see that we use to go into all these items in Joomla. What I'm going to do is use the site side, and as you can see, I can select the bees, click default. It'll change my entire site to this bees template. I'm going to go over here and refresh and you'll get to see what happens. Completely different look, different coloring, but you can see it automatically took all those styles that are in its style sheet and applied them appropriately to the correct areas. This one is a little bit more graphical. Now that's the reason to use templates. Pre-formatted, put together, I can click on anything and the rest of my pages are automatically applied. This is so much easier than typical templates. Usually if you have a website and you're editing it in a web application, you change your template, then you have to update and upload all your pages that are connected to that template. Don't have to do that in Joomla. They've made it so easy. You just select the template, apply it, all the pages are automatically connected to your template. Now, I can click on the template and go take a look at it in the Template Manager. Right here you can see the different parameters that it will allow me to change. I can change the logo text. It gives me two different types of menu options. Template font size and so on and so forth as you go down. All of your templates are going to have a little bit different parameters for you to choose from. You'll also notice your templates have editing options up here. You can preview the template so you don't have to actually install it till you see what it looks like. Right here it's going to show me my preview so I can see what that looks like. Then see how you can see those different areas of the site, the different positions are on here to show you where those are located. I'm going to click the back button because it doesn't automatically apply it. I can just preview it. I'm going to close out of that one. Let's go to the metal template. The metal template is one that I installed. See how you can see there's different parameters here. I can click preview to see what that would look like. And again, in red there, it's got the different areas showing me what those positions are. User 7, User 1, User 2. As I scroll down, I can see all of those items. And here's those user, whether I want that decoration off or on in that area. So you've got lots of template options. Go in there and apply a template that you think would be fun to look at on your site. Take a look at those options. Now, in the next movie, what we're going to do is actually go out on the web, 
find some templates, bring them down to our computer, and then install them on our website so you can see how that's done.